This is Insider Medicine in 60. From New York, a U.S. Federal Advisory Committee has voted that Avastin should not be approved as a treatment for breast cancer. It was found that the drug's ability to slow the progress of breast cancer did not outweigh its toxic side effects. Avastin is approved as a treatment for lung and colon cancer and is widely used off-label as a treatment for macular degeneration. From Boston, Results of a new survey show that while most doctors think incompetent colleagues should be reported, less than half actually do so. The survey of over 1,500 doctors found that 46% had first-hand knowledge of medical mistakes but didn't report them, while 45% were aware of bad behavior by other doctors that they didn't report. The survey also found that 10% of doctors admitted to violating patient confidentiality. And finally, from Chalk River, the shutdown of an aging nuclear reactor in Ontario has led to a global shortage of radioactive materials used in medical tests and treatments. The reactor was shut down because an emergency power supply was not connected, violating national safety regulations. The shutdown of the reactor, which produces two-thirds of the world's medical radioisotopes, has already cost distributor MDS Nordian $4 million in lost sales. For Insider Medicine in 60, this is Dr. Ening Struby.